Welcome back to the Hank Strange Situation, Lifestyles of the Locked and Loaded. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Hank Strange, and uh, we're doing something a little bit different today. We are bringing you flashlights. Specifically, this is from Olight, and it's the H1R Nova, which is a rechargeable and detachable LED headlamp as you can see right here on the box so I haven't opened it or anything like that I'm actually gonna open it up and uh, start using it and one of the reasons why I wanted to start doing some flashlight stuff I think I've done a little bit of things in the past is that I really believe in carrying a flashlight all the time it's always in my EDC this is what I currently have here this is actually from Caltech believe it or not and I like the fact that it has that you know that little trigger to it. This is what I'm, I'm carrying right now on me all the time, but I am going to, I'm looking for options to have, you know? So this is not necessarily what I always want to carry. And I'm looking for different options. I think you should always have flashlights with you, just as important as anything else if you're into everyday survival, everyday carry kind of a thing, um, like myself. So this is 600 lumens, it's battery included, it's a rechargeable battery and it actually has a uh, magnetic USB attachment on it. From what I saw, I found Olight at SHOT Show 2018 this year and I thought, you know what, I'm going to get into this and try out Olight and see how it is. Obviously it's manufactured in China, so price-wise, which I know people always ask me, this is in the 60s, it's less than 70 bucks. So you can get this either on Amazon or directly from Olight and quite a few other places. We do have a link in the description of this video, which you can follow and get stuff from Olight. Uh, we got into their affiliate program, so just to quickly explain that to folks out there. That means if you're interested in this, we're not trying to make you buy anything, but if you're interested in this, you can buy it and it you can at the same time help to support the Hank Strain situation. So um, that's what's going on with that. You'll find it in the description. You know what? Enough of that, let's actually open this up here and uh, get the packaging out. It says, read me. Um, okay, we'll put that down there. Yeah, the read me section. So, um, not bad little box. By the way, I do work with Big Daddy Guns and uh, Olights are now also available in Big Daddy Guns. We were all really, really impressed with what we saw at SHOT Show, so we got into it. Um, there's a little warning here. Uh, We'll put that right with the readme thing. So there's basically the light. And uh, looks like there's some kind of bag or something in there. So here's the light itself. I mean, relatively small. And, uh, you know, easy to use. So like I said, this is my first time getting in here. So let's see, is this charged? I don't know. It doesn't look like it's charged or anything like that yet and this is what I believe is the magnetic USB charging spot that you guys will find on it I don't know if it's focusing I'll try to get the camera here to focus on that so there you go this is the light itself we'll put that on the side it looks like there's a, some kind of carrying case or bag or something like that in here along obviously with more instructions so let's get in there you know nice little bag it has like a felty kind of touch to it you know they're obviously trying to class it up a little bit a drawstring bag that you can put it in when you're not using it uh, feels like there's something else in there okay two little drawstrings there you go very nice definitely uh, appreciate that kind of stuff um, the rest of the packaging in here just looks like uh, this is a brochure of the other stuff from Olight. They have more magnetic things. You'll probably see that here in a second. See, that's the USB cable, and it has this magnetic head that's just going to attach to it. From what I saw, instructions. We'll put all of that off to the side here. And excuse the clutter. I'm actually in the studio of Big Daddy Guns, where I do most of my work nowadays. So here we go. Here is the actual headband part of it. There goes the headband. Let's see, we got some rubber bands on it here. We'll take those, we'll take that off. So, headband and USB cable in it. So if you really needed to, you got a headband, you could put that on. You don't always have to have it. You know, you can use it without it, but if you really need to, there's the headband. And here is the, um, what we were talking about, the magnetic side of the USB charger. 
So let me just get it to focus on that if we can. There you go. And pretty much the way that that works is, uh, see that it's wanting to move and that there, boom, there it goes. So it magnetizes like that and then you plug this end in to uh, recharge it. So let me, uh, I think I've got a, of all my stuff here, I've got a USB port over here I'm going to plug it into. There we go, USB port plugged in. And um, can you see that? There's a little green light on there now that's illuminated right there. So this light is set to charge. You know, um, I think there's probably something else here that's keeping it from coming on. Probably something you have to twist here. So I'm going to take a break right now, go through the, the manual real quick. That's my uh, least favorite thing to do. You know what, let me just go through the readme. Let's see, let's go through the readme and see what it says here. It should be uh, simple, it's telling you how to unload the lamp and uh, how to remove the stainless steel pocket clip with pouch, how to attach and detach the light. Oh, and then it looks like there's an insulating film in there to protect it. So let's uh, go in here and remove that. Uh, you know, reading is fundamental. Look, there it goes. Insulating film. Remove it. <laughs> we'll put that off there. And then here's the batteries so that you guys can see. It looks like it's one. Um, and it comes with this battery from Olight. looks like a uh, CR123. Let me see if we can get it to focus in this light here. I don't know if you guys can really see it, but it's uh, basically, uh, it says RCR123A, so that's what you got going on here. We'll put that back in. I think that's the right way. We'll find out right now. 600 lumens in this little tiny thing? That's amazing. Let's see. I'm going to put it right into the camera here. Whoa! Holy crap! <laughs> Dude, that is really, really freaking bright. Wow! That's amazing. Look at that. Whoa. That is a bright ass light, dude. Let's see if it does anything. Can I quick flash and hold? Does it... Looks like it's going up and down and changing some, on some kind of strobe here. It would obviously take me time to mess around with it, but damn. That is a bright... That is a very bright light. And, uh... I think they, they have the instructions here on how to attach and detach the light to this thing. Um, it looks like they basically want you to pull it through here. I'm assuming that what you have to do is remove this and then pull it through here. I don't know. Um, probably. I'm not doing it the right way. Don't worry about it. I'm sure someone will tell me, you didn't do it the right way. Okay, you know what? We probably have to take this off. And it looks like it just, you know, you can just snap it off like that. There you go. Remove that. I don't, I don't like reading instructions. As Babyface always says on my channel, big strong man. Big strong man don't need no freaking instructions. So this goes on your head. And then I'm assuming you can just go sideways with this, push it in through here, and uh, don't don't break the camera. Whatever you do, okay. And so you got something like that it goes on the head, and uh, then you could press it, and you got light in front of you. That's a that's a, a low mode right there. There we go. See, it's going up in intensity. So now it's on the high intensity. And when you take it on and off, it comes on with that. And if you hold it, it looks like it goes down, changes intensity levels. So um, this is probably the lowest one right now. You guys can see that here. I'm going to hold it and change it so that you can see it blinding you in the uh, camera. So let's take that off again take it out of uh, the headset here, the headband, and uh, snap back on 
the clip which goes around something like that there you go so now it's got the clip back on it and you can put that in your pocket or something you know what this is really cool obviously this is my first time using the H1R Nova and um, this is actually my first Olight I think I'm gonna get into more of these because I really like the idea my favorite thing I have to tell you guys game changer for me big deal in this whole thing is this magnetic <laughs> charging that is amazing see and now it's going it's on uh, it's on red so probably whatever charge was in there we used it up maybe the red is indicating that it's charging and uh, perhaps when it's fully charged and all that but I like that idea so if you get into more of these which I think I'm gonna do you can have like how I have the USB cable here attached on my desktop you can have that attached and then you know or in your car you, know, you can have one in the car one at the office, one at home, and when you've got your particular light on you, you just attach it like that, which I think is different from the light that I showed you guys that I was that I'm carrying today, right? You know, if I if that battery dies, I have to either have all the batteries on me or go buy them at the time, and um, I think this is really really convenient. We obviously have to test it more and see how many times can you recharge it, how long it takes, and all that kind of stuff. How durable the light is, how tough it is. And uh, I will do that and bring it back to you guys and probably even talk about it on the podcast. If you're, if you're on the podcast tonight or some other night and we t we're talking flashlights, um, ask me if I've got this in my pocket because I probably will. At this size, 600 lumens, I think, it's not bad. And then as I said earlier, if anyone out there is interested in getting the H1R Nova 600, lum uh, 600 lumens rechargeable and detachable LED headlamp, there is a link in the description that you guys can follow to get this. Okay, now that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm out of here. We'll keep this sh short and simple. Peace. Here we go. One last look. One last look.